Google's new Chrome Web Vital IMP is meant to track user feedback in your applications, but I have not found that to be true at all. Let's look at a quick example. I have the subscribe form here, and when I hit enter, it makes a backend request to the backend, and that thing waits for four seconds before responding. So you can see I do enter, and then one, two, three, four. Now I get feedback that this email already exists. So that's a very poor user experience, but if I were to open the Web Vital extension, it's still showing a good score, even though this user experience is horrible. So what's the secret here? Well, the secret is that IMP only tracks things that are blocking the main thread. Since in this case, I'm making an asynchronous request to my backend, it's not blocking the main thread. So INP is really not tracking user experience or feedback, it's just tracking the blocking of the main thread. You can actually have a terrible user experience and a good INP score. It's kind of confusing. It almost feels useless.